It's me again, brother. Back every week, just like I promised. So hard, though, man. I miss you being on my side, man. They out there looking for me a new partner and stuff. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. I, I can work better alone. If I, I'd rather work alone than without you. But I guess I got to stay strong for you, right? I guess I got to learn to control myself, though, because you know me. I get so mad, I just want to just shoot somebody. But you know we can't because we go to jail. <laughs> you know, you used to calm me down all the time, you know. Well, you with me all the time, bro. All the time. But you by my side, in that car with me. I miss you, bro. See you next week, okay? donate money so that we can build a community center, um, somewhere that people can go to feel safer. And after this tragedy that happened with the Soul and Bones, we're hoping that we can provide a place where people can go when they're having troubles. That sounds great. Have you considered or looked into the legalization of marijuana to help your cause? Well, I don't personally advocate the use of drugs, but I did find something in Colorado. Oh, here it is. Um, that if we stop spending tax money to keep people from doing things that they're obviously going to do anyways, and instead provide a service to support our responsible use of the substance, that more money becomes available and it can go to help things like this. I think I like what you have going on here. I will uh, donate 5000 to the cards if that will help. Um, um, yes. Do you take cards? Um, actually we do. Perfect. Th thank you. Would the facility have programs for those with mental illnesses? I certainly hope we'll be able to get some medication, you know, so that we can give it to the people who need help. We're definitely hoping to have therapists on staff. Will there be a room to play video games? Of course not. Okay. So, do you have any idea this stuff's going to be going towards like arts and dance and musical type stuff? Of course! The arts are incredibly important, and I can't imagine the center without them. Having the arts in schools is definitely a benefit. Some kids, they don't even get a chance. Someday they could have the next Beethoven, but he doesn't even get the chance, so. I want the center to be somewhere where people can express themselves in a positive manner. Sounds fun. I have to go. I'll have someone relieve me. Uh, okay. See you later. Victoria and Inez, hey, how's it going? You uh, you all hear about Nikki Griffin, I guess, huh? Yeah, Ricky asked us to stop by and help make arrangements for Nikki's release. She's finally coming home. Yeah, Good. she's still in a coma. But, but she doesn't have to stay in the hospital anymore. Yeah. Yeah. I don't imagine that Stephen Cameron's still going to be her caregiver. Not after he stood up for me and Chrissy Robinson Mercer case against that team of doctors. Those creeps took his license away just for that. I'm just sure that's not the reason they gave. I mean, they would have... Uh... No, they trumped up some bogus charges against him. It doesn't matter. They still took away his license. 
Well, who's going to be stepping in? Nurse Hickers. Oh, she's great. She is. She's very, very competent, so everything should be fine. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, well, I guess we shouldn't hold you up. Yeah, yeah. good to see you. Nice seeing you. Miles, great to see you again. AC, what do you think of the new offices? Sure. So what was this opportunity you were talking about? I presume you brought me to proper for a reason. Uh, my colleagues and I are prepared to send a few clients your way. God knows the one thing proper needs more than anything is good therapist. <laughs> uh -huh. We'll mostly be covering the bill, so you don't need to worry about that. Sounds a little nefarious. Oh, nothing like that. A little covert, maybe, but nothing devious. You do understand I can't violate any confidences or divulge any of my patient information. We would never ask you to do something like that. <laughs> what then? We might want you to nudge them in certain directions occasionally. Get them to do certain actions, cultivate relationships, things like that. So you want to use a licensed professional therapist to manipulate others into doing your own bidding? You know, you just make it sound so dirty when you say it like that. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do you think? I'll do it. Welcome to proper. Yeah, thanks. I've been warned. <laughs>